How does Neuralink work? Technology is everything in this growing world and Neuralink is one of the best innovations in the world of tech. Neuralink is a brain-machine interface technology that allows humans to interact with machines using their minds. It is one of the company owned by Elon Musk. Today we're going to discuss about Neuralink and how this company works. So if you are interested in knowing more about this awesome innovation, you are in the right place. Before we dive into the topic, make sure to like this video and subscribe to our channel as it really motivates us to make more awesome videos. Elon Musk's ambitious project is to connect the human brain to the internet in order to control machines. It is almost ready for commercial use. Neuralink is a device that will be surgically implanted in your brain, allowing you to communicate and even control machines. It will also aid in the study of brain electric signals and the development of solutions to various medical problems. Live monkeys, pigs, and other animals are surgically implanted in the brains of Neuralink's devices for testing. As per the recent news, this chip was inserted in the brain of the monkey and after six weeks, a company claimed that a monkey started playing video games on monitor. This is one of the greatest successes of Neuralink. Elon Musk demonstrates the Neuralink brain planted into a pig. Elon Musk demonstrate his startup Neuralink's technology to build a digital link between brains and computers by surgically implanting a device into the skull of a pig named Gertrude. The pig's brain activity was shown via a wireless link from the Neuralink computing device as it snuffled around a pen on stage. Musk also illustrated a second-generation implant that is smaller and fits into a small cavity in the skull. The brain's outer surface is penetrated by tiny electrode threads, which detect an electrical impulse from nerve cells, indicating that the brain is working. The threads are designed to communicate back, in line with Neuralink's long-term plans with system-generated signals of their own. Musk described that the device is like a Fitbit in your skull with tiny wires. With 1,024 thin electrodes that penetrate the outer layer of the brain, it communicates with the brain cells. There's also a Bluetooth connection to an external computing device, though the company is looking into other radio technology to dramatically increase the number of data links. That demonstration showed neural activity being wirelessly broadcasted to a computer, but it didn't reveal any of Neuralink's long-term goals, such as a computer usefully communicating back to a brain or a computer understanding what the spikes of a neural activity mean. Previous work by Neuralink Since the launch of Neuralink in 2019, Musk and the company have only published one scientific paper, which was published in the Journal of Medicine and Internet Research in October 2020. The paper detailed the development of the robotic device, which consists of an arm capable of delicately inserting hundreds of thin threads into the brain, each about a tenth of the width of a human hair. It's dubbed the sewing machine because it can insert six threads per minute, each of which is made of flexible plastics and has 192 electrodes. Interfacing with the brain of rodents was the focus of the company's early research. Musk and Neuralink detailed two Neuralink systems, A and B, that were tested on rats in their October 2020 paper. The former can insert over 1,500 electrodes, while the latter can insert around 3,000. A free-moving rat attached to the system B with a USB-C slot protruding from its head is described in the paper. Significant technological advances must be addressed before a high bandwidth device is suitable for medical application, Musk and Neuralink acknowledged. How will data be transferred via Neuralink? Since its inception in 2016, the company has dedicated to the advancement of this technology. The N1 chipset from Neuralink will be installed in an 8mm diameter skull with multiple wires housing the electrodes and wire insulation. A robot will surgically implant these wires into your brain. The wires are as thick as brain neurons and as thin as a strand of hair at 100 micrometers, according to the company. To target different parts of the brain, multiple devices can be implanted inside of the skull. What is Neuralink and how does it work? Remember the blockbuster film The Matrix? Remember the scene in which Neo, played by Keanu Reeves, learns martial arts by simply downloading a computer program into his mind? Neuralink may not be able to teach his martial arts, but it will be able to control machines by sending and receiving electric signals through the brain. Currently, the company claims that we will be able to use our thoughts to control basic devices, such as our smartphone, computer, and possibly even type. To understand how Neuralink works, you must first understand that our brain uses neurons to send information to various parts of the body. These neurons in your brain connect to form a large network and communicate using chemical signals called neurotransmitters. This reaction produces an electric field which we can record by placing electrodes near it. These electrodes can then decipher our 
brain's electrical signals and convert them into an algorithm that a machine can understand. Neuralink will be able to read our thoughts and find a way for us to communicate with machines without even opening our mouths in any way. The N1 chip's purpose is to capture and simulate electrical spikes in our brain. We'll also be able to learn new skills with the help of a dedicated app. Neuralink currently uses a Bluetooth radio, but this could change in the future. Whatever form the technology eventually takes, it will undoubtedly be wireless. In fact, it is one of the Neuralink team's top priorities. How can you use the Neuralink? The project's initial phase, according to the company, will focus on assisting the healthcare industry. The machine will be able to assess paraplegics with simple tasks such as dialing a phone or using a computer. And it's also possible to use it to treat epilepsy. Musk stated in the interview that the device will be able to help people regain their vision even if they have lost their optic nerve. In theory, he claims, this technology will be able to fix any problem with the brain. Neuralink can also be used to restore a paralyzed person's memory speech, and movement, according to Musk. He also stated that after a complete symbiosis of technology and the human brain, humans will be able to interact with one another without having to speak. Imagine being able to read someone's mind. We will also receive additional hardware that will allow us to stream music directly into our head. With technology like this, telepathy is no longer a far-fetched concept. For the time being, however, Neuralink expects to be fully developed in at least 5 years. Well, that's the end of today's video. If you enjoyed the video, hit the like button and comment down below. Also, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell if you're new to the channel to be notified when we upload more content. 